This is Royal Television. We inspire. Uh, good afternoon, uh, my name is Adegun Ladebukola and uh, I'm here uh, reporting for Royal TV. Today we'll be talking about the views of people concerning uh, Lagos parks. We notice that a lot of people don't even try to patronize the parks. We wonder why. Is it because the Lagos um, governments are not allowing people into the park? Or is it because they don't get familiar with the park? Or is it because we are not used to the park naturally? Or is it because there are a lot of things hindering them from accessing the um, parks and the gardening? We have a lot of beautiful gardens in Lagos that the Lagos has actually created for our own relaxation but it's so unfortunate that people are not coming here to have fun so that is why we the royal tv crew made it upon ourselves to come out and seek for the reasons why these parks are not being utilized so stay tuned and um let us go on this ride together and see sample people's opinion concerning our uh, lagos parks and gardens don't go nowhere we'll be right back Sometimes I, maybe when I just have something in mind to, to get up, I'll just decide to come here alone and then sit down and just, just reason out and then pick it up my mind. But sometimes I just, I, I always use here with my friends to just come sit down, have some fun and then go back. It's just a free and open space. It's free. Just look at this place now. You can see a well active man coming to this place to come and have the insurance. Because of this death thing or uh, something like that. Because uh, if he gets to some area of the Keja, you see, yes, people came there. Even bring their family there to see some other people there. Some people used to come here, you know, for shooting pictures and uh, snapping, you know, doing some little birthday and other things. Challenges we face is uh, sometimes uh, we the, the, uh, the area boys, uh, or they, they do rob this place and uh, sometimes, you know, uh, the, the dirty and uh, the lilums, uh, other things. Maybe sometimes they will even urine here or, uh, you know, shit here so, and so on and so on. But we are, we are still bearing and uh, we, 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 we are still cleaning the place. We steady, steady and steady and steady. The park is safe itself as it is. Um, you don't force people to come to places like this. They come by choice. In some days, some weekends, evening times, you meet some people here, come here to read. Um, people that come for interviews come here to like freshen up and um, you know refresh their memories and all that. But I think one of the reasons why people don't come here is because well, it's a matter of choice basically. It's not like it's not safe. Although in some cases, maybe during festive periods, um, Christmas. It's, the whole park is literally lit up. I really think that people people love safety. People love to keep on living life very free without anything adding or subtracting to their life. As in, what I mean, I, I, I was thinking maybe the government can do something about it. Maybe we create the park again and then doing something about stuff like this can be very dangerous. Uh, maybe create something that create something on top that that to be free for that even kids can come around because definitely if this this place become very beautiful parents who love to come weekends yeah. with their kids okay. so it's it should make it in such a way that anybody can come maybe a kind of protection that kids can Actually, jump over oh, okay. yeah yeah I, I i know for one they're they're trying to tackle it because what came about this was called waves of water 
Okay. Taking in the sand from underneath okay. and just taking it back. Wow. They've always initially when this park was new, okay. it was flat. Wow. But over time, sand was coming in. Fine, we still put sand and rubbles underneath it, but hey. since the water is so there, it's always. Going so to it's sand. something. It's a structural defect that I'm sure Lagos State will take care of very well. I want to say thank you for staying tuned and it's still your favorite TV station, Royal TV. Right now we are at Muri Okwala Park. You would agree with me that this is so lovely, so, so lovely. Very, very cool environment. There's no any sign of hoodlums around, no sign of touts around. The security here is tight. The um, environment is so clean. You would agree with me right from where you're seated right now that this place is a place to be so please guys let's come out you know saturday sunday come out and have fun it's for free no get free hello no get free just come around okay let's have fun so let's just go around and see what the garden looks like i'm telling you it's beautiful I'm the security in the park. Is it allowed for people to just come around? Yes, you are free. Before 5 30, I don't open this gate. In the morning? In the morning, then close by 7 30 in the evening. Okay. Then people come and sit down. You want to read, you read, you want to sit down and discuss with your friends. Come bring your friend, you sit down. They uh, normally rent this place for the party or something like that. When they come, then we refer them to Allah, sir. Okay. Then when they pay, they give us the receipt, then we allow them to enter. Well, today the journey continues and it's all about the use of parks and gardens in Lagos State. We notice that people don't really make use of these open places. Reason being that only God knows. We don't want to judge and we don't want to speak for them. But today we are, as you can see right beside me here, in the Bisikano uh, Park, very, very close to the governor's office. It's a very, very big one, a very, very big and beautiful one at that. Well, let's just go inside and have a view of what the old park looks like. Don't go nowhere. Let's take a walk. While passing, I said, let me just check in and see what is happening here. Because I find out it's a very good place. It's a recreational center. It's beautiful. So as I came in, I have to ask. Because I didn't know whether they're paying or not. So I just asked. They said there is no, you can't, there is no, there's no, there's no okay, charge, yes. no payments. I was surprised. So I feel relaxed and I said, let me walk in and relax. Day in, day out, as I come to work, I use the park and it's more convenient for me. 